at one end of the ice, it's a chance to close it out. At the other, there is no tomorrow. Hi, everybody. James Sabalski here for EA Sports. Game six is ready. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. Every game critical in the postseason. This one, no different, and we are underway. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And some good footwork to kick it away. Takes the puck. Wicked slap shot. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Scrum along the boards. They battle for the puck. Takes the feed. Such a swooping in on the attack. Gets the full use of his stick on the coach. They score! And just like that, it's a one nothing hockey game. Well, they started like a freight train just steamrolling their opponent, James. I, I mean, they really dictated right from the onset of this game. That tells me one thing. They were prepared coming in. Greenville's aggressive start has paid off because they've got one on the board. They've got one on the board. They've really set the table, James. It's all ready to go. The meal is about to be served because they have been all over their opponent right now, especially being the away team. You want to send a message early, playing real aggressive. Moves it to Slutch. Handles the pass. The Swamp Rabbits play it along the blue line. And he puts that one aside. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Swamp Rabbits lead it 1-0. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. He might have a step here. Cuts it wide. The Swamp Rabbits gain possession. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Big time defensive play. Florida's working hard and it's in the back of the net. He scores! Two quick balls in a minute 30, James. Cheryl, you stress consistently. Keep your feet moving on the ice, and that pays off. Well, they got the pedal to the metal right now. They're like a freight train. Come to play tonight. They have been busy on the offensive scoreboard. The Swamp Rabbits get a hold of the draw. Tries to feed it across. Takes it the slot. Stops that one. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. inside the offensive zone. Denies him! Cornet is dialed in and anticipating the play so effectively, making a huge save from a dangerous spot on the ice. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. That opportunity is rejected. Side is the call. Lots of time left in this period. The Swamp Rabbits have recently taken a two goal lead. They'd love to build on it. And off the draw, they win the face off. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by Kemp. And he takes the dish. Shot with the stop. Greenville's got a hold of it along the wall. Bednard's made a great save there, and it's really important to reset after a blowout. I mean, here in the playoffs, every game is important. It's important to get a great start, and he does just that. Here's a short pass for Freeman. Oh, what an insane stop by Cormier! Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. And he makes the save. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Martin. Quick pass 
to Freeman. He carries the puck up along the wing. Florida's got control of it now from their own end. Good job, come on. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. And somehow he hangs on. Across the line from center. Florida's got the puck inside the defensive zone. The Everblades will play it in their own end. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Puck scooped up by Sambra. Puts it high. Sometimes there's pressure on players when they get into that prime time scoring area. And because of it, they rush the shot. And I think that happened right there. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Slides it over with pace to Martin. Gains the zone through center. Here's a pass in front. Picked off in front. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. The Swamp Rabbits have put a lot of pucks on net here in the first, and they continue to lead. And they grab possession of the puck after that center ice face-off. Florida's got the puck in the defensive end. Steps inside the line. Here's a chance. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point-blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. The Swamp Rabbits are being called for tripping. A chance to capitalize here on the power play. First opportunity on the power play in this game. And specialty teams are the difference so many times in a game. Huge for them to set the tone and really get the setup and the looks they're looking for. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Florida's got a hold of it against the wall. The Everblades have it in the offensive zone. Reaches out and uses the stick. Quick shot, and that goes off a player. Quick feed to Pendenza. Here's a shot. And he stags that one with the gloves. Pendenza is ready to take the draw here on this power play. Florida's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. There's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. 2-0 is the score. Pendenza has won the face-off here in the offensive zone. The goaltenders are just so good in this league, James, that they see the shot, they are going to stop it. And so you got to get traffic in front of the net. On this power play, they do an excellent job of getting bodies in front of the paint. The Everblades are showing some life here in the back half of the first, and Cheryl, they got one back here. Well, and at a critical time here, the remainder of the first period at bay, this is a team that now has some confidence as they shorten the gap within one. Florida's going on the attack as they gain the zone. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Pass the puck away. Stops it with the glove. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Martin's able to steady his team defensively and still contribute points. Cormier's well respected and a great competitor between the pipes. Be on the lookout for one of these players to make an impact for their team tonight. Now, let's send it back upstairs. Scores! What a shot! They're striking quickly. Two goals in 50 seconds, James. And as quick as a hiccup, we are all tied here, Pounder. I'm not sure what's going on right now. The goaltender's trying to play the game of percentages here. He drops into the butterfly position, making himself as big as he possibly can. But guess what? There's a few inches available up high, and the shooter converts. 
Puck possession, so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Florida's won the draw. Steps inside. And he slides it quickly to Mobley. Greenville's looking to break out of their own end. Gets the puck in deep. Florida's got the puck. Looking for space inside the D zone. Slides it over to Moberg. Gains the zone along the right wall. Greenville's gained possession along the boards. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Into the offensive end now. And that's a great heads up play in the offensive zone. Slides it up front. Great poke by Greenway. Takes the feet at the back end. Throws it on goal. And that shot gets caught in traffic. And it's a quick pass to Jostling. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Oh, competitors say just when you think that he's completely out of it James he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive moves it quickly over to Darcy takes the puck into the oh he saved it what a stop now that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind and he's going to be the foundation tonight such an impressive save, James, and I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position, it's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out-battling and out-willing everyone around you. Here in the late going of the frame, we got a tie game. The Everblades win the draw, now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, he stops it with a glove, great reflexes there. Oh, what a smart heads-up play. From in close. And that goes off the player in front. We got a penalty coming up here. Right up the gut into the offensive end. There's the whistle, and here's the call. That'll always be a call. If you extend your arms in cross-check, you're serving two. Look at the power play. An opportunity on their first power play of the game, James. And this is an opportunity to look at the coverage as well. See how they're playing it, whether they're going to be aggressive or sit back. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Takes a shot. Here's a shot. Oh, and he steps up with the glove to stop that one. And Denza's ready for the draws that will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And they send it down the ice. Moves it to Such. Centering feed. What a goal! I really like the way they move the puck around to wait for the right time to be able to move that puck for the one-timer in that low slot area. He didn't have much time to get it off, but he got some wood on it and buried it. The Swamp Rabbits take the lead after that last goal. And Cheryl, what do you wait for here now? Do you, uh, do you anticipate the counter punch or do you look for the continued push attack? Well, uh, you got to continue to push attack. There's way too much runway left in this game, James. You're in the first period. You got to find a way to continue to compete, continue to maintain the momentum, and put your opponent on their heels. Greenville's got the hold of the puck. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Quick feed down low. Here's a shot. The Everblades move the puck in the defensive zone. On the attack along the boards. Denied by the goaltender. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. The Everblades have had their opportunities, but they just can't capitalize here in the late stages of the opening period. Florida's won it. Now they'll go on the attack. Of the body to force 
cuts the puck loose. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. From the place 99 made famous. Takes a shot. Comes up with the stop. Hammers the shot. Big stop just as time expires in the period. There's the horn. Still 40 more minutes left in regulation time. We'll get to the second period right after this. You could win ringside tickets to an upcoming game. Welcome back, everybody. James Sabalski with you. Period number two. The middle frame ready to go. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? Bednar's been fantastic in the game so far, James. I mean, he's the only reason his team is still in it. The Everblades gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Bednar's going to hang on for the whistle here. It's been a ho-hum night for him. Well, it really has. He hasn't been tested, but it is a close game, and he's got to come up big. He has to stay dialed in and focused in this one. Still plenty of time left in this frame. It's a one-goal hockey game. 3-2 is where we sit. Such has got it in the offensive zone. The Everblades have it now. Picked up along the boards by Everly. Drops it with the glove. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Florida's looking to convert on some of these chances. They've had plenty of opportunities, but have been snake-bitten thus far. Nice job tying up his opponent. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Strong defensive effort. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Teams are ready for the draw. The line's been about to drop the puck. The Swamp Rabbits win the draw here in their own end. Greenville's got it in their own zone. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Into the attacking end. And a stick break set up. Florida's got a hold of the puck now. Blocker save. Too many bodies in the way. Here's a short pass to Everly. Loses his balance on the play. Greenville's got it in their own zone. Pokes the puck away. Greenville's got it along the wall. A centery chance! And that's stopped! There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And they continue to apply pressure here. Nice feed at center, moves up ahead now. Oh, save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James, and the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Let's have a look at that last save again. It was absolutely incredible. You're under pressure, you're under attack, really under siege, and you find a way to get to the puck. This is the stop that champions are made of. Lots of time left in this period. The Swamp Rabbits have a little breathing room here, but not much as they lead it 3-2. Swoops in and grabs the puck with the centers tied up in the scrum on the draw. Greenville's got the puck against the half wall. Turned aside with the glove. Scoops up the puck now. Takes the pass. Stales plays the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. I'm not sure how he kept up to that shot right from the slot area, James, but man, he flashed the leather. He made the save. No rebound to boot. The Everblades have had more scoring chances, more shots, but they still trail early in period number two. Florida's got it, and they're on the attack. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Quick pass to Riley. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Quick feed to Riley. Sends the pass over. From the slot, fires away. Battle along the wall. And a heads-up kick pass over to his teammate. Odd man rush. Shot and makes the save. And he keeps possession. Carpenter's got it in the defensive end. 
Moves it quickly over to Pendenza. Poked away at center by Kemp. Puck picked up in the open ice. And now it's grabbed by Kemp. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. And now he moves it quickly to Carpenter. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. Excellent stick work on the play. Sends the pass in front. And that doesn't connect. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Moves it to Kemp. Oh, smart heads on play to put that one away. Carpenter's lugging the puck. Florida's ready to go on the attack. The Swamp Rabbits gain possession along the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Throws it in. Florida's got the puck. Gaining momentum along the wing. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. Well, it's kind of hard to protect a one-goal lead when you're sitting in the box and your team's short-handed, James. The PK unit's going to have to find a way to save off the power play here and get the job done. Listen, a power play, you want to make sure that you're getting a high percentage shooting shot. And that's exactly what they did earlier on the 1-3-1 where they were able to capitalize. It's about opening up lanes, getting the coverage to move around, and then firing and executing when you have it. Puck slid down the ice. Here's a shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. I really like this save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. The Everblades get a hold of the puck along the boards. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. Taken along the wall by Such. Takes it and looks ahead. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Lewis is almost back in the play. Florida's power game can't score. They're still down a goal. Well, when you have the player advantage and you're down by a goal, you have to generate some momentum. And the first stop is putting it in the back of the net. And now they're back at even strength, trying to get back on the board. Made the stop on that play. Denies him again. They make some consecutive saves there. He's got to be wondering where his defense are. I mean, how about a little help? Well past the midway mark of this period, Greenville's got a 3-2 lead at this point. The Swamp Rabbits win the draw. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Oh, textbook poke check to turn that over. Into the attacking area from the left side. The Swamp Rabbits have it against the wall. Handles the puck. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. The Everblades gain possession. Florida's got a hold of the puck. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. The Swamp Rabbits take over on possession. And sends it just out of reach. And he takes the feed. Off the ball, and gets on the inside of the post. Florida starting to generate more chances. This is exactly what you want in the game is you have to find a way to get it back to equal. This one goes off the pipe, but they can't get frustrated. Just continue to pump away and generate those opportunities. They put the puck into the offensive end. Quick feed to Pendenza. Toss it up in the neutral zone. Greenville's gained the line and into the zone. Sends it to the middle. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. The Everblades need to find a way to convert on one of these scoring chances as they trail here in period number two. Greenville's got it in the offensive zone. Misses over the net. You're in the slot, you gotta hit the net. Moves the puck into the attacking area. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Cover, cover. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Getting into the later stages of this period, Greenville's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. 
The Swamp Rabbits start with the puck in their own end. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. With possession along the wall. Great reach with the poke check. Slides it back to the blue line. That's blocked. The Everblades gain control of the puck against the wall. Grabbed along the board by Stales. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Here's a pass down low. Quick pass to Everly. Grabs it in his own end. Moves it around along the half wall. Fires it on net. And that's blocked in traffic. Newbers moving it ahead. Takes it across the blue line. Greenville's got possession of the puck. Russell's moving the puck through his own zone. The Swamp Rabbits played along the wing. Oh, fantastic save by Cormier. And that shot dies in traffic. Scrum ensues along the boards. Here's a short pass to Such. Sends a pass over. Now it's picked up by the defense. Dumps the puck in. The Swamp Rabbits gain control of the puck. Nice bank pass off the boards. Dumps it into the Ozone. Cormier's really impressed me tonight, James. Just look at that last sequence and that desperation Shoot. save. Unbelievable. I mean, when it's required to be calm and poised, he's got quiet feet. But when he needs to move and make a desperation play, he does it. 40 minutes to play in the books. Both teams will get one last chance to catch their breaths, and then it's on to period number three next. That's good for $10 off your next purchase of $50 or more. Tickets must be redeemed within a week of the game. You're having a great night. Two periods down, one more to go, and they're ready to drop the puck here on period number three. They have dropped the puck here in the third. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now. In the Scores! And look who's right on the doorstep, and he didn't miss that one. That's what you call taking advantage of a fortuitous rebound, and you have to be able to smell it and sniff it out because he has great hand-eye coordination to be able to pick that one up and put it in the back of the net. The Swamp Rabbits pick up right where they left off, and look at this, a quick goal here to go up in the third. Yeah, and that's deflating for their opponent. You can see it in the body language, and that's also a signal to them that they need to continue to press attack while they're down. And off the draw, they take the puck. Along the half wall with the puck. Florida's got the puck. The Everblades have it now. Here they come. Takes a shot, and he makes a save there. Bednard's been really sharp tonight, James. And then just have a look at his save percentage. And he's making the stops that he needs to. But man, his team's played well. They've got going north. They've created opportunities. And the reason why, they have a healthy lead. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Big hit, and that frees up possession. Great reach by Such. Cormier's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Florida's had plenty of good looks offensively, but they cannot convert, trailing early in the third. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Keeps possession. Here's a shot. Oh, great reflex pad stop by Bednard. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Swamp Rabbits have some breathing room as they lead by a pair. It's 4-2. Florida's won the draw. Quick shot. Shot. 
Looks like lineups are set and they're ready to get things back underway. The Swamp Rabbits win it in the defensive zone. Slides the cross ice pass. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Florida's got control of it now from their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. The Swamp Rabbits will play it in their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. And he takes the feed. Moves it to the middle. Goaltenders use tracking exercises all the time, both on and off the ice. You can see the frustration after the goal as he's trying to find this. He's trying to out-battle, but he can't get a sight line, and it winds up in the back of the net. Greenville's added yet another one here to the total tonight. What a performance. Yeah, they've had the puck on their stick for a majority of this game. You know the coaching staff is going to be impressed. Hey, maybe they'll get the day off tomorrow. Slides the puck over. Great use of the stick here at center ice. The Everblades will play it from the defensive zone. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Shot! Stones him in front. That's an incredible save, James. I mean, he's got presence in his crease, and he's also got a great glove hand, and he shows it right there with that save. Lots of time left in this period. The Swamp Rabbits just recently adding to their lead. They're now up by three. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Greenville's got the puck in the defensive end. And he takes the pass. Quick feed to Everly. Puts it on net. Fantastic save! Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Greenville's got a three-goal lead here. They're up 5-2. Puck picked up by Darcy. Florida's looking to break out. Across the line, down the left wall. Quick shot, big save. I love that he swallowed this one up with his glove. It's a th real threat coming from the slot area. No rebound to boot. The Everblades need to find a way to break on through here. They've had plenty of shots on net, but they've got to convert here in order to even things up. Florida's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. Bednard's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been outstanding all game, James. He's the reason why his team is leading in this one. And Alex with a good decision to get the faceoff. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. And that carries off a body in traffic. Right side set up ahead into the middle of the ice. Moves it quickly over to Stales. Now a quick pass to Such. Change up, Moves change the puck up. along the half wall. Here's a centering pass. And he denies that great opportunity there. Long leg pass into the open ice. That stretch pass is a beauty, James. And that goes off a body. Darcy's got it deep in the offensive end. Greenville's got a hold of it along the wall. And he loses control of the puck. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Martin. Moves it to Moberg. And that's deflected on someone in front. Picked up along the wall by Stales. Denies that opportunity. Look at this attack here in the O zone. Here's a hit. The Everblades cross the blue line and are on the attack. Oh, and he keeps it out of the net as it goes off the glove. They just keep coming in waves here in the offensive end. There's a hit on the play. Florida's got the puck along the boards. The Everblades looking against the half wall. Fires it! Scores! A huge goal here has put the ice back into this one. Yeah, and if they can get one more, they'll be 
be one away from tying this game up, James. So it's about building and continually finding ways to press and be aggressive on the puck. The Everblades are trying to shift that momentum in their direction after that one. Yeah, they've had the majority of the possession, James, but it doesn't matter, does it, if it doesn't convert to goals. Florida's won the draw in the neutral zone. The Everblades played along the boards. Oh, he misfires on that. The Swamp Rabbits get a hold of the puck in their own end. Florida's got a hold of it against the wall. Nice save from point blank range. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Sends it down low. Takes the lead at the point. And it comes up with the save! And the puck's not loose. Slick feed. Well, the game certainly isn't predictable, is it, James? As it's going back and forth. Scores! And look at that wave! Hang on a second! count the official waved it off immediately oh boy no change in the scores that goal was waved up and we are ready to drop the puck again and off the face off they take possession handles the pass from the right wing and that's broken up. Takes the feed. Greenville's got the puck along the wall. Too much congestion in front. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Florida's gained possession along the boards. Snapper from the slot. Stop that one. Now he takes it over the line. play right there. I mean, he's stumbling. He looks like he's going to fall almost, but he's off balance, and that's the key. The puck isn't exactly where he wants it, but he still manages to find a way to get a shot off. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Here's a shot! And there's a glove save on the play! Past the halfway mark of this period, Florida's got to find a way to get a few more goals here as they still trail by a pair. Away. Unloads from the blue line. Answers the call with a big save. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Florida's got to be frustrated with how things have played out tonight, trailing in this third period. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. And the puck's booted away. Florida's got it in their own zone. Feeds it on over to a pack. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Taken by Greenway. Here's a chance. And that one's turned away. Uh -huh. Beautiful defensive effort. Newbers taking it from his own end. The Everblades take it along the wall. And there's the save. Point. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Sends the feet in front. Oh, and they can't connect on the pass because it was broken up in front. Greenville's through center and now in the offensive end. Great read with the stick. Quick pass to Carpenter. Line the Everblades carry it along the wall. Takes the shot. Just gets enough to keep it out. There's another stop. This is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. 
Florida's goal has suddenly tightened the gap here in period number three. Well, they're within one, James, and it's not enough right now, so they're going to have to continue to counter, transition quickly, but most importantly, retrieve the puck. That is critical to be able to possess it. Greenville's got the puck against the boards. Florida's moving it along the wing. Pumped away. The Swamp Rabbits scoop it up along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Aberle. Receives the pass. Greenville's number one line has been dominant tonight, James. They've been in the offensive zone. They've created a ton of opportunities, and they're a reason why they're in the lead. Who had the edge? Carlin's standing by with the answer. Martin's got the edge in our matchup tonight, guys. He may not have any points, but he stayed with it and played hard for sure. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Quick feed to Jostling. On the attack along the boards. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. Takes the feed. Approaching the final minute of regulation. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. The Everblades move the puck in the defensive zone. Scooped up along the wall by Jocelyn. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. Whistle blows, stopping the play. A tough penalty to take as you're looking for the equalizer. You're in a one-goal deficit, and you got to find a way to generate offense, James. Real tough one to take. Swamp Rabbits send their man advantage unit out once more. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. The Swamp Rabbits take it across the blue line. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Uses the boards with the bank pass. There's the horn, and that's the hockey game. Best two words in sports up next, Cheryl. Game seven. So entertaining from all angles, right? Your fans, us in the booth, and how about the players on the ice? I mean, how amped up are they for this game seven? You know, it's going to be intense. It's going to be something small that makes the difference. But both teams are going to leave it all on the ice to be victorious in this series. Well, and that brings a fun night of hockey to a conclusion, and we will say goodbye. She's Cheryl Pounder. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us from all of us here at EA Sports. Good night.